What is up, Travel Squad? We are back at it again. Back at it again. And today, we're starting off the day doing something unique, kind of fun, because I'm a big fan of the 80s. Normally, I don't usually go to a workout, but this is going to be the VHS workout, which everyone kind of knows version 4, I yeah. feel like. So, super fun. Hopefully, it doesn't really feel like a workout. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited for the 80s tunes. But they have our shake weights, and I know Fane's been really excited about this. Oh my those. gosh, OK. All right, go, go, go. <laughs> I mentioned it one time as a joke, and now it's becoming my thing. You wanted to do this 80s class. You just had so much excitement when you mentioned it, though, so I just feel like it made an impact, you know? The one thing about this, though, is that we did not, like, reserve this, so we're trying to go early to see if we can find a spot in the class. We might not even be able to get in. We might yeah. get like, hate from outside the club. <laughs> I mean, it literally is in the club, so that's kind of funny. But honestly, I didn't, I would, I didn't realize we actually had to book it, so it was booked up by, like, the end of day one. We had to wait a little bit, but here we go. Yeah, there were 17 spots left, he told us, so just get here early enough. There was no line behind us for standby. Mostly because everyone's already hung over from last night. Yeah. I think so, for sure. Okay, so we're doing an 80s workout, and here are the shake weights. They have a lot of shake weights. Here you go, Faye. Thank you. Can you show me how to use it? Come on. Thank you. I like that energy. Y'all sound like you're ready to sweat. Well, welcome here to DHS. My name is Karen the Spartan. I'm here to get you going. Get your hand Get you ready for your day. The warm up. All right, nothing too crazy. Nothing too wild. Just some nice little marches. Ready? Right? Here we go. And march. Yes. All right. Go. Yes. All right. We have three legs. Have two arms. Are you ready? Again, we go in. Here we go, Laura. Ooh, that was just a warm up, and that was oh, that was. I'm sweating. I thought oh, wow. the warm up was the workout. They have water over there for us, and they also have a tub of pedal and seltzers for sale. Just the fact that they're just like, here, have some, have some alcohol while you work out. How's your, how's it going so far? The team's pretty fun. I'm enjoying it. It's definitely entertaining. It doesn't feel like I'm just working out. Uh, faster, harder, harder. <laughs> Break number two, what's going on? We have a break, I'm using it. You didn't think this was gonna be like this difficult? I knew it probably would, cause I haven't worked out in a bit, but it's, I, yeah. That's all right, hey. At least you're doing it, at least you're making effort. We have section number three now. Grab your shake weight. <laughs> So how was that? Ooh, I loved it. Baby, I'm feeling it. We're gonna be sore tomorrow. A little bit, especially from all the squats. Just a warm up. The uncoordinated dance moves that yeah. I probably pulled muscles trying to do. Oh man, okay, at least we have a break. We're gonna premiere a video, the Carousel video. What is up, Travel Squad? We are back at it again. Back at it again. And today we are trying something new, something that we haven't done in maybe since cruising started again. And then we can get freshened up and go to brunch. Brunch. Workout done, premiere done. Now it's time to grub, get some brunch. And have bottomless mimosas. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. 25 bucks for bottomless. It's so, going down. I guess this is the only vlog we're gonna, like the only part of the vlog. You can say goodbye. Okay. Thank you guys so much for joining today. It's been really great. But today we are checking out brunch at the wake, which is at the back of the boat, the after the ship. This is nice. See, I've kind of hurts walking down the stairs because you just worked out. It feels kind of like a, a, a regular like cruise ship restaurant, but classier. I just want to let you know that I called early and got us a corner booth in the club with the ocean view of the app. Wow. We could have got a table that's like right next to it. I don't want you in direct sunlight because I know you had a lot of sun yesterday, so I was looking out for you. So I wanted like a little shaded area. Ew, treat me like a queen. Always. Wow. 
This looks fancy. This is a full on menu. Oh, wow. Look at that. You got a screw this. You got a filthy Bloody Mary. Oh, I want a filthy Bloody Mary. No, you don't. You hate Bloody Marys. Then we have some a Bellini. This is the bottomless brunch we were talking about. These are all bottomless right here. You have some wine, some beers. You can pause the screen if you need to. They have lunch as well, which is also an extra charge for the raw bar. And then here's the brunch options. Oh, Benedict, I'm good. I'm happy with that. I'm conflicted. So I see several things I would like to eat. Well, good thing it's on a cruise and we can order whatever we want. I know, but I don't want to like cancel out the mimosas. Oh, you want to get your buzz on today? Yeah. My bad. Last day, best day. So if you're curious, if you still buy this, you can still get all these different drinks and you can switch it up. So you don't have to just stick with like mimosa or Bloody Mary at the time. Look at this, look at this. Oh, wow. I need an app-facing room. If we had an app-facing room, we would never leave. I would never leave. Put that hammock up in our yeah, room. Yeah, I was about to say, like, especially with the hammock. If we had a double-wide balcony with that hammock facing apps, we would never leave. I would sleep out there. Starting off with some shrimp cocktail. That looks so good. These are pro shrimp. I will not be trying that. Do you know why I'm doing this? Why? For my boy Kyle Paolo. He oh, because he likes shrimp cocktail, right? Yeah. And then also we got the bottomless, but she bought us three mimosas by mistake. There's about to be like 10 more glasses on this table. 100%. Let's see if we can keep them on the table to see how much we have at the end. Cheers. <laughs> I've never seen cube sugar like that. You're fancy now. Where's my Splenda? I'm sorry, that's not me. Why'd you not choose me? Ooh. Okay, now it's you. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> to a little um, virgin life hack, we notice if you wear the L's and T's, if you cop the L's and T's at C shirt from travelsfreeltc.shop, you'll start getting two mimosas at once instead of just a typical one. Just saying, cop the merch. Bottoms up. Should I just like try to all at once? Come on. It's whack a doodle time. <laughs> it's whack a doodle time. Oh my gosh, that's not going in. Ooh, a little fancy salt in like a clamshell. I want this for like our house. Like, it's just cute. Ooh, it's big chunks of salt. That steak though, looks moist and bussin'. Moist and, that's the new L's and T's. Mo moist and bussin'? Moist and bussin'. <laughs> MB's. And here's my eggs in a basket, which is like an egg and like a piece of toast, but I wasn't expecting it to look like that. Mm. What, too much salt? That's some sea salt. I don't know who this is for, but I know it's for somebody, so here you go. I love to watch it bust wide open. Bro, you've been on Virgin way too long. <laughs> <laughs> what I really like about this view right here of the wake, it's like legit like right there. So it feels like I am at almost at sea level and I can just like look into the water. I don't know, if you guys like wake videos or wake clips like this, let us know in the comments I'm like. I feel like this is extremely calming and mesmerizing just to watch. We pretty much just closed down this brunch place. When we are about that life, we are really about that life. Let's see what Laura says. Cool. What's up? Last mimosa. I lost count. We've had a decent amount of mimosas. Maybe we should go book a cruise. Does it sound like a good idea? <laughs> a nap sounds like a good idea. So we're making bad decisions today. Let's make some bad decisions, baby. Let's turn that pineapple upside down and make some bad decisions. Chill. So you know what we forgot? What? Hi, I'm Laura, and this is my first drink of the day. Asterix, like 30th drink of the day. <laughs> I literally lost count. I, I want to say this is at least seven or eight. Hi, I'm Laura. This is my eighth drink of the day. Why did you put your tongue in the drink like that? Okay, okay. We need to go. We need to go. Why are we here? Why are we at the next cruise place? Whip out that credit card, baby. Oh, I forgot that. I should probably need to get my credit card. I'll save our spot. And just like that, we are booked on our next Virgin cruise. I would say we made bad decisions, but I think that was a pretty good decision. We have $1,400 in sailor loot. What is life? That's crazy. And then she added the deep blue extras on top. I'm I'm pumped. So, so if you want to come on the sailing with us, we're actually doing the Christmas sailing. We tried to do the New Year's like we mentioned in the live, but it was already booked out that we're doing this, the Christmas sailing. I've never done 
done there Christmas on a cruise ship before. I feel a little weird about it because I like being with family, uh, right. but I mean. We can go see family for New Year's it and it'll be okay, but this will be like a really nice, right, like kind of break one, for us, I think. $1,400 of just free money. Oh, I'll be in the spot every day. Right. Is that time of the month? I mean, is that time of the cruise? That time of the month. <laughs> is that time of the cruise? Laura's outfit. Look at that. It's Vici, for anyone wondering. I like the colors on it. Thank you. I feel like it's very like virgin. Yeah, I think so. Do a, little, do a little spin. Do a little spin. Nice. Open back everything. You did a good job. Thank you. So tonight we are at a Razzle Dazzle. You can see it on the door. I love all the stripes. <laughs> the mimosas are doing this job. Feel a little dehydrated? Very. But look at the menu right here. Razzle. Dazzle. This is more the vegetarian vegan restaurant, but you can also order meat here. It's under like the feeling naughty. And then here is the menu. You guys can look at it. Laura. What is that? Why is that your drink right now? It's a box of popcorn. Popcorn old fashioned, which I'm sure you've seen in a lot of Virgin videos, but I just felt like I had to get it. Is it real popcorn on top? Yeah, I already know what that meaning is in there. Mm -hmm. How do you, do you know where to, like, to put the straw? Or you just I think put it you in just there? stick it in there and see what happens. Cheers. Ooh. It's an old fashioned, but it's a very sweet old fashioned. So is this like a cup down there or something? Yeah, there's a cup in the popcorn thing. That's so weird. So I got a cob salad. Or what did you get? That's the mushroom tartare. Gross. And it came with um, a few pieces of like toast. That's the only tartare I would not eat. I'm not gonna lie, this looks disgusting. There's popcorn in your drink. Here you go. You don't even know, you didn't even taste it. Five minutes later. It was nice at first, but I just kind of want to drink it now without worrying about the popcorn getting more soggy. It was still nice. I still liked it. I thought it was like a platform above the popcorn and you just put your straw in like a hole, but it's actually in your drink. So we kind of forgot to record our food. This wasn't the best. It was pretty dry chicken breast, but that's understandable because it's chicken breast. Laura has some fried chicken and then also some tater tots. What are you thinking about the food for dinner, like the main courses? It was pretty good. I was I was impressed. I didn't expect much for Razzle because I feel like a lot of people don't talk about it. I finished all my chicken. I asked for white meat only, so I got bone out, which was really nice. Now she's just eating my pasta. <laughs> this pasta is really, really good. The funny thing is, Laura introduced me to these espresso martinis, and I've got one too. I was proud of you when you canceled your Sprite order and got that. All right, well, we're leaving Razzle Dazzle. I wasn't the biggest fan out of all the places. It was still like good food, but out of all the places, it's probably my least favorite that we tried. I kind of want to get more food somewhere else. I think it was still better than your average cruise meal. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty good because I polished mine off and had a little bit of yours, so. Now we're doing some karaoke. Wow, got a bottle. One of our new favorite subscribers. Hey, top. <laughs> Thank you. That was fun. I wish we could have recorded it, but it's like a lot of copyright music, so we can't do that. But karaoke was pretty dope. So the fact that we had so much fun, we're actually gonna see if we can book a private karaoke room right now. We can let loose by ourselves. We still owe Tony from the bet that we did oh, oh, like on That's Thunder, true. Symphony. Yeah, we owe a um, all-star. Let's see what the next challenge is. Hey, 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 what's up, Laura and Fane? The challenge is this, it's very simple. I wanna see you two singing karaoke duet style. Unfortunately, it looks like we will not be take, partaking in karaoke tonight. We have another sailing, so we should be, we can be able to do that. We messed up. Yeah, but we're learning. We but the thing is, we're gonna come back stronger and better than before when we'll we get on. We'll know next time. We yeah. can hear people in their rooms. So that's just a note. If you guys actually wanna do karaoke, make sure you go early, like probably early, like the beginning of the day, just to sign up for the time you want, because last minute things on this cruise ship do not work really well. No, that is something that we have come to know very well, especially with the shows. Do not get there, even on time, get there about 15 minutes 
prior, there's really not going to be any extra seating. Why are we acting like that's like new news to us? We've been on so many cruises and I that's know, like normal. You can normally at least get seats like in the back or something like yeah. that. Here it's been, there's nothing. Yeah, we almost missed the 80s workout because we had to wait in line. And also everything books up on, online, so make sure you reserve your spot. We weren't able to go see some of the shows that we wanted to because they either booked up or it's just like, we just weren't really paying attention. So make sure you come up with a game plan if this is your first time on Virgin. I think we probably should have known better. We dropped the ball. Well guys, that is it for our first ever cruise on Virgin Voyages Scarlet Lady, or Virgin Voyages in general. For the most part, it was a pretty solid cruise and we de I'm glad we're doing it again. I'm glad we were able to kind of get like our lay of the land coming yeah. on this one. We did have a few bumps in the road and maybe felt a little discombobulated at times, but it was still amazing despite all that. And I, I still absolutely love this cruise line. Also shout out to our room attendant because he took off the cover for this and now it's like actually cool in this room. I can just stand here and just have this giant breeze on top of me. If you guys enjoyed this cruise series, make sure you check out our other series on the world's largest cruise ship. Wonder of the sea, baby. Bye guys. Bye.